the story of water in the valley, of course, goes all the way back to the Hohokam. But the more modern story of water in the valley starts uh, around 1865 when Camp McDowell is established just northeast of the Phoenix area. And with that came a lot of development. You have people, you have businesses coming into the area. And Jack Swilling was one of the people who came to Phoenix in that time period after the establishment of Camp McDowell. And he came together with a group of other gentlemen from Wickenburg and they really saw the potential of this area. And they actually found an old Hohokam Canal pathway and began excavating that pathway in order to construct what was later called Swilling's Ditch, um, the Swilling Canal, the Salt River Valley Canal, it has many different names, which was the first modern canal in the Phoenix area. He and the other gentleman that he started that canal with really saw the potential of this valley. And they understood that if you could get a water supply here, which was the very same thing that the Hohokam had done before them, if you could get a water supply to this area, it was a perfect place for a city, a perfect place for farming, a perfect place to develop.